isolation volley challenge first, but I want to introduce you to my family who are here with me in isolation. We have... Hello, I'm Charlotte. Hi, I'm Becca. Hi, I'm George. And we're going to show you the volley challenge. Say I'm with Charlotte. Just make sure you're not too near anyone so you don't hit them on the head. So in pairs, see how many you can do in a row. Nice chopper grip. Move your feet if you can. See how many you can do. Just add them up. So what we'll do is we'll show you. Becca and I will go together, George and Charlotte, and we'll see which pair can win. Are you ready, you two? Yep. Here we go. One, two, three, four. <laughs> We got how many you on? 39. Oh, 14. Beaten by the kids. So annoying. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Oh. Two. Just oh. Well, just okay, how many, what was your high score? 50. 50. 50. Did you make that up? And are we no. trying to go? Are we actually oh. trying, to, we actually trying to get more than that? 49 or 50. 49 or 50. 50. Okay. Yeah. okay. Go, so I'm you can see how it can cause a bit of excitement in the garden. If you are on your own, you're isolating on your own, you can do just straight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, see how many tricks. So the first one we're going to do is the scoop. So you go on top of the ball and then underneath it, try and lift it up. Do you reckon you can do that, family? Yeah. Fab, give it a go. Oh, it's in complete silence, love it. <laughs> Was that too easy? Did you manage it, Becca? too easy for everyone so we're going to go on to the next challenge which is a foot flick so you get the ball to your racket lift your knee and flick it into your hand looks very cool when you're walking around on the tennis court so good time to practice it <laughs> I don't think that was right So we've, we've um, conquered the racket flicks and the scoops. Then we're going to stick our rackets down in a safe place. We are in the garden, so just be careful there aren't anything you can fall over. Okay, and we're going to have a go at juggling. Okay, here we go. You're ready for this. So we're going to throw one up, then let the other one go, then the other one. <laughs> ready? Sorry, my family are making me laugh. <laughs> yeah. Okay. To demonstrate. Right, guys. Oh, George is offering to demonstrate. <laughs> <laughs> okay, don't you hate it when your kids are better at stuff than you are? Pretty annoying. <laughs> okay, fabulous. Right, let's grab our racket again. Good job, everyone. You can practice these. See if you can get better. All right, so we've all got a racket each. Whoop. Charlotte's still going because she thinks she can get better than George. <laughs> That's going to be her summertime off practicing in isolation. Okay, then. Racket out flat, ball on top of the racket. We're going to take the ball around the world. So what I've done is I've got a, like a little group of challenges. So this is a slightly easier one if you're a bit younger. I'm sure... Uh, here we go, around the world. Then go straight up and down. See if you can go straight up and down. For this. <laughs> can we use, uh, we use the other trick, Mum? Yeah, we well, maybe. Or you throw it up? Maybe. <laughs> George wants to throw you his, show you his throwing up trick. Go on, George, show them what to do. Whoop, should we all have a go? Whoop! I'll try and get without bounces. Oh, oh okay. You can throw as high as you can. Oops. Try and get it to that. Uh, okay, okay, go on, go on. Hey! <laughs> okay, don't do this too near any windows if you're going to go as mad as George is. Okay, then we're up for our next challenge. We're going to do bouncing on top of the racket. So nice and easy. Just see if you can do it like the volley challenge. Once you're finding that fairly easy, I forgot that. Oh, guys, you're looking good. Okay, try a twiddle. That's one either side of the racket. 
one either side of the racket. You can have a little competition who could do the most. Do it all day. Do it all day. Is it? Ooh. Not as easy. Okay, so if that you could do that all day like George. We're gonna go for side ups. Ooh. Rack it on the side. See how many? One, two, three, four, five, six. Gone off camera. Let's everyone else have a try. See if you can beat six. Oh, how many, George? Nine. Nine. Oh. Okay. So see if you can get beat nine, girls. You can do it. Oh, here we go. Give it half hour shot. Keep going. <laughs> oh, you got eight, yeah. Not nine, though. <laughs> oh, sorry. I'll go for ten. Ready? Whoop. Well done. Wait, you're holding it. You're cheating. Oh, I see a bit of cheating <laughs> going on. <laughs> holding it halfway up the racket. <laughs> Not sure about that, guys. So we think we ought to hold it on the handle. Oh. On the handle, not on the uh, throat. Oh, I only got three then. Doing well here. Okay, so we're off for a magic twirl now. So the ball in the middle of the racket. Dun, dun, dun. You have to whiz the racket round and try and catch it on the end. Way! Okay, see if you did you get that, Becca? Oh, yeah, sorry, sorry I moved, moved, didn't I? So you like go racket. round like that. Oh. So we basically keep the ball on the racket. Let's try and keep the ball on the racket as if you were on like a um, fairground ride. Oh, I did a perfect one then. Typical, isn't it? Way! Whoop! See, ah, see if you can get all the way round. You can go all the way round. So that's a magic twirl. All those games that you can do on your own. <laughs> but we're now going to go on to a couple of fun games that you can have in the garden with the kids. We're going to go round the world. So this is a cooperative game. So you put your finger on your racket like this. We have to go in a circle. And then when I say go, oh, maybe a bit nearer, we have to go for the next person's racket. Ready, steady, go. Hey! Should try and get caught out Ready, steady, go! <laughs> Again, ready, steady, go! Hey! Ready, steady, go! Okay, we've got it. Okay, so we're going to make it a little bit more tricky. I haven't tried this, so we'll see if it works. So grab a ball each. All right. Oh, here we go. So we're going to balance the ball on top of the racket. Did you see how we got a bit closer then? Quite a competitive family we are. Oh, George can't balance his. Have we got it? Ready, steady, go! <laughs> okay, I dropped it, but everyone else caught it practically. Okay, whoops, a daisy. Okay, are we ready? Are we steady? No. Right. Oh, we did it! Okay, can we try once more? Because that was, might have been a Put your hand straight on top of the ball. Right. Okay, put your hand on top of the ball. Bit of a cheat here. Ready? Steady, go! Oh. Hey! <laughs> can we do one more? One more for fun. Ready? Steady, go! Yes! We did it! What a fabulous family. <laughs> what can I say? Okay, we are up for the next one. Ooh, okay. For those of you who found uh, some of the other exercises, this would be a bit interesting. I'm going to do a, um, I'm going to do a sort of like progression. So, one of us puts our racket down. George, if you put your racket down. All right, just chuck it on the grass. I think put it in a safe space. Safe <laughs> space. I don't know. Oh. Right, so say we're playing with Charlotte Becker. Charlotte, can you move that way? So we're going to progress. You know that volley rally we did earlier? If you're struggling with that, your partner's going to throw you the ball and you've got to try and catch it. We've got this. Oh, <laughs> oh remember that chocolate grip, Becca? You can remember. <laughs> That's it, you got it. That's it. There you got this. Lovely footwork from Charlotte with her little legs going in. Right, so if you crack that, Oh. <laughs> oh dear. Make 
sure people stand a safe distance apart. <laughs> then make sure there's nothing on the floor. Is the floor clear, George? Can you just put your racket out of the way? Right, because <laughs> what we're going to try and do... Can't get the staff. What we're going to try and do is move along with Charlotte volleying like this. Are you ready, Charlotte? Here we go. That's it. Can you manage to move and catch the ball? That's a bit of a lump in the grass there. Go slowly if you've got lumpy grass like us. Are we going? Yeah, go. You can follow us around the roundabout. Sorry, you can. Sorry, this is definitely our back garden, as you can tell. The neighbour next door, David, because we're going to leave the people doing that. Nice. Okay, nice. thank nice. you. Right, way, go on then, round the roundabout, see if you can do it. Oh, we're nearly there. Coming around. Come on, back up. Wait. Ah. Last one. Wait. Okay, then. If you want to, you can try the volley challenge again, both of you volleying at the same time. But we're gonna go on to the next one so you can see a rather fun game. We've got two bags and we're gonna hand those to, oh, Becca and Charlotte. So can I take your racket, Becca, and we'll stick it over there. That's it, this bag. All right, so you ready for this, George? Sure. Right, I don't know how many balls you've got at home, but I'm hoping you've got a little tube of perhaps four, two tubes of four. I'll drop them just to make them work hard. <laughs> All right, Charlotte, we need to be in a space for safety. Okay, now you can do this really close if you think you, you need, if you've got little people, or you can go further away if you've got really good players. Okay, so here we go, using that volley. I'm mostly working the air because I know you've got rough grass and it might be tricky. <laughs> right, how many balls have we got? Four? Four. Right, first team to get the four in the bag. Right, ready? Hang on, wait for it, wait for it. I know what you're like. Same distance apart. Here we go, ready? Steady. <laughs> Steady. Go. One. Hey! <laughs> Oh. oh! I think we Dead just heat. Heard it. I think we heard we... our bag rustle first. <laughs> <laughs> we think we heard our bag just rustle by first. a millisecond. Yeah, yeah, I think we slightly won that. So we're going to reverse it. Go on, Charlotte, you're up. Oh, I've got a catch now. Here we go. There's your four balls. You could make this ten balls. You can make it four balls. If you've got more balls, you can go however who just gets the most. You can move people further back. You can move, move people further in. Should we about level? Ready, set, go. Oh. Two. Three. Four. Yay! Yay! That's my fault, <laughs> I only catch that one. Did you not catch it? Oh. oh, does that mean we're the winners? High five, all isolation high five. Is it one Be careful. Is that one all? Is that one all? Did you say? I think we won that. Yeah, okay, yes. guys, hopefully we've given you a few... Um, fun uh, tricks and challenges to practice in isolation and we'll just all say goodbye thanks ever so much bye <laughs> see you later <laughs>